climate change is not the greatest existential crisis or threat facing society. That climate change is the problem is in fact a social construct. It's something that we've made up and for a variety of reasons. First of all, we have to understand that thinking that climate change is the existential threat reflects our mechanistic linear Cartesian reductionism at play. This is kind of a something we've inherited from the, the uh, scientific revolution in the Enlightenment. And it also reflects that the modern human mind has a limited capacity to cope with real complexity. Well, why is this problematic? First of all, the current obsession with climate change is a distraction from the real problem. And that means that we can't solve climate climate change by focusing on climate change. Now, those are very challenging assertions for a conference depend or rather focusing on climate change, but I want to support them now. <clears throat> climate change is only one of many critical assumptions of something that we call ecological overshoot. Uh, we can define overshoot as a situation in which the human enterprise is using resources faster than ecosystems can regenerate and generating wastes faster than the assimilation capacities of the ecosphere can uh, absorb and, and recycle them. So that's overshoot, it's endemic, and it is the source of all of the current problems, acidifying the oceans, toxifying fresh waters, overfishing the seas, degrading landscapes and arable soils, the expanding deserts, the destruction of tropical forests. Uh, it's the driver of biodiversity losses. And we could have extended this list two or three stories uh, below the, the floor here. Uh, so the point is then that each of these is an independent symptom of a much greater problem called overshoot. Climate change is one of these symptoms, but only a symptom. And you can't fix climate change in isolation from these other symptoms of overshoot.